I'm gonna get my gun. I'm gonna get, get, give me my gun. Give me the gun. Shut up, give me the gun. Hey, Diddy, you look old enough to use two firearms at once. <laughs> yeah, I'm not insane. It's a peanut gun. I can use peanut guns. <laughs> da, 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 da. So you're doing right now, Diddy Dude. Think I want my next big thing. Donkey Dude, Diddy Dude. Duck dude did dude. He's funky dude. Funky dude. Cranky dude. Cranky dude. Candy do that. <laughs> candy do. <laughs> well, she's a girl, so candy do that. To that. To that. To that. Hey, look a banana. That we can't get. It's a ghost banana. Ooh. Scary. Look the camera on the bottom right. It's like whoa. What? Would you go to that cave? A ghost camera! Uh, uh, where'd that come from? Die, B. Boom! Take that. I'm gonna eat your uh, heart watermelon thing. Oh, I love watermelon. Yeah, watermelon is a solid fruit. That's actually mostly liquid. But, um. <laughs> <laughs> But no, I just, I would love some, except that it's, you know, 10 degrees outside, and it's not exactly the season for watermelon for right now. You need to get seedless watermelon, though. I hate the seeds. Oh, They're no, it's so the annoying. Part of the reason watermelon is so enjoyable is because it's like, so simple to eat. Like, just, just... Also, have you ever seen like watermelon sculptures? No? Is it just like ice sculptures with watermelon? Yeah, it's like it's just like the shuffle just carve out the watermelons. But they do like really cool things with like with the rinds. Like they'll cut it out to like the edges of whatever are the rhymes are the rinds of the watermelon. And because it's so like manipulable, like they end up looking really good. That's cool. I'll have to look that up. That sounds cool. I like sculpture stuff. I like like ice sculptures and sand castles and stuff like that. I was just wondering, I was like, why wouldn't you just make this out of anything else that doesn't just disappear? Yeah, it's a little depressing that, like, so she ice said. sculpture just slowly just goes Melts. away. Yeah. I guess it's part of the beauty. Except that after, like, the first... Well, no, actually, most of them are cool. If you have an ice sculpture, you usually have a cool one. Okay. Or, like, sandcastles that get washed away like, yeah. really fast. That's actually the only way I built sandcastles as a kid. Like, I never built, like... A big castle on shore. I would always try to build a like a small castle near where the waves broke, especially like when the tide was coming in, so you could like get a little time to repair. Mm -hmm. And then I would just put walls and moats and ditches in front of it and try to protect it from the ocean. And so, just you know, there was nothing you could do. Like maybe I was just using the wrong technique. I built some pretty good moats. But at the beach. The thing is, just time. everything washes away. I was able to divert it pretty well. I, I wasn't doing it by myself, though. I helped a lot of people that were working on it. I mean, I like a team. Yeah. I mean, I still can't do it. I guess I, I usually am over ambitious and start where, like, once the tide comes in, gets hit, like, every, like, 30 seconds by a wave. In which case, it's just going down no matter what you do. Yeah. Oh. But well, it kind of showed me the power of the ocean and the futility of my efforts. <laughs> it was great, cause you, just sit, you just sit there in the sand for like four hours and just keep building sandcastles until you got heat stroke and burn. And that's just all gone in one second. Yeah! I remember I saw one of like the actual like professional, or maybe not professional, but you know, hobbyist sand sculpturist. Where like, they make like the crazy ones, like where they have like their br air brushes and all that nonsense to make it look fancy. Yeah. And it's like they just can carve like this dolphin out of the side of like the sand dune. It was just like so good looking. I was like, come on, people can't actually do this, can they? Well, ice sculptures are really impressive because with like sand castles, they have like small tools and stuff, but ice sculptures they do with like chainsaws. Yeah, like ice picks and. I mean, I was never artistically inclined and yeah, I, wasn't really either. I have I have troubles with arts and crafts 
I legitimately almost didn't pass kindergarten because I couldn't cut with scissors. Really? Yeah, like, my teacher, like, contacted my mom about it. <laughs> like, he just, he just can't do it. And I was like, I'm sorry. Yeah, I didn't have any trouble like that. I think, it might have just been my school was just... They expected too much of you? Or they just, they just had weird things they thought were development signs. Like, my sister had, like, had concerns in second grade when she couldn't skip. Why do you need to skip? Exactly! Like, what is this? She's like, my mom's saying, she's like, oh, yeah, your, your daughter, she can't skip. And my mom's like, so what? Like, yeah, what? Like, is that a problem? Okay, can she read? And like, <laughs> well, it could be a sign of, like, Asperger's, make, you know, retardatron. I'm like, oh. Retardatron. I'm like, gonna think of another disease name. <laughs> so I decided to make it a robot instead. <laughs> I am Retardatron. <laughs> Fear. Me. Uh, me. But yeah, it's like, it's like such weird things. Nothing over here. Can you flip over that gate? I don't think so. I don't know if anything was up there. Oh, can you go to the left there? To that gate? Oh, I didn't even know this was here. Blow it up! <laughs> Did it not blow up a gate? <laughs> nope. What? I might need that dash move. Oh, uh, maybe. <laughs> no, that doesn't work. Explosives don't work! I've tried everything I possibly can. Explosives don't work. Let's try running into it really fast. Ooh. What? Oh, yeah. Mm. What? <coughs> Did it say that when you came in? No. Ah! Oh. <laughs> that just like disappears. Hey, that five was gone. That five wasn't there before. Why do you need to get up there? Um, I don't know why I would need to teleport up here. Let's go see the fox guy. Actually, we don't have any blueprints. That's not yeah, gonna pretty dumb. help at all. Um, switch to Donkey Kong, cut that banana. I was just about to do that. And I was gonna shoot that dude. Yeah, DK! <laughs> <laughs> you know what my favorite part about Donkey Kong is? What? He's not Diddy Kong. <laughs> <laughs> Diddy Kong is cool, I don't know what you're talking about. Uh, uh. So what else is in this level? You gotta go to all those things. That door is in this level. That door is, and in, this that level. Door is in this level. And that door. And that one. <laughs> so you got a bunch of doors to go through. <laughs> Ow. He's like gets old like as he's falling. <laughs> Uh, Diddy guy. His hair. Oh. Well, I'm not Diddy. So I can't use oh, his hair. Oh, is that how you tell? The hair color? Yeah. It's a pretty neat way to do it. Like a nice subtle way to do it. <laughs> oh. See, I can't get it. Uh. You can't get any of this stuff. Yeah, you can. You can get that. Whew. Bananas. Teleport thing. The little plop is like adorable. The banana plop? Yeah. All these old rare games, all these like N64 era rare games have such good sounds. Blue. Not blue. Anything else in this room? Oh yeah, could you not go you can go up with slopes, right? No. Randy. Let's go get Randy. 
Oh yeah. Well, let's get. Let's talk to Cranky first. Yeah, Cranky. Let me go to Cranky's next time. Ah, oh, I already went in.